All right, this is the video on how to set up for candle making. First thing you're gonna do is pull the wax forward and make sure you have this tile on the floor to catch any of the extra drips. You're gonna have to move the power outage thing closer because it does not reach. You're gonna find this cord in this drawer and turn it to 250, get this sucker heating up. And then all of the scents are right here. All of the colors are across here. And then the jar styles are up front. Our canisters to pour the wax are right there. All of the candle making supplies, it says candle supplies, and then the scales are in these drawers. Everything that you need, the wicks, the stickers, the stirs, um, the hemostats, and then the little candle wick holders, and the wood wood wicks, and the wax wicks, everything that you need is in here. If you notice something's low, you need to let me know. Scales are in this drawer. And then you're going to uh, find that you might need to find more jars. All of the boxes are underneath this counter. So everything that you need for candle making is here. The wax warmer is also right here. So if we are going to refill candles, you burn the jar and we're actually recycling some old jars today. So you just take that, you heat it up on the burner till it melts and pour it out. Now we can reuse that jar. I think that's everything that you need to know for candle making. Um, there is a little sheet that I'm gonna leave in the candle drawer of all of the measurements for whatever size you're doing. And when you're pouring the colors, you're gonna wanna use the just droppers if they don't have a little drip spout. And then obviously clean everything up nice and neatly. There is a scraper to get any wax off that looks like this, and it will be in the drawer as well. And last but not least, if you're out of wax, we're gonna keep the big box of wax here, but this is all the wax that we have currently in the studio, and then we'll bring a new box once that's done. So that's your candle making.